Hello and welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's well. So today I will show you around the Petworth House. The 17th century Petworth House displays one of the finest art collections, including artwork by Van Dyck, Turner, Reynolds and Gainsborough. The Somerset Room named after the proud 6th Duke of Somerset who bought several of the paintings that originally hung here. This room would have formed part of the Duke's much larger servants hall. In 1795 this room was split into two with half becoming the square dining room. Here you will see magnificent paintings. These paintings are so beautiful to look at. You need to spend some extra time here to appreciate them. These state rooms were designed to display wealth, taste and royal connections. I must say the artwork here is the most precious and unique. As you will see here, few pieces of furniture so precious and unique as well. The interiors are so impressive, I could stay here for a very long time. So the square dining room is frequently compared to a family photo album with family portraits featuring seven generations covering the walls. Such a treat really for art lovers to spend their time here and to look at such precious and stunning family portraits and paintings. All the paintings and artifacts look so magnificent and amazing that you just can't help but just appreciate their beauty. So that's the Marble Hall, originally the main entrance and known as the Hall of State. A formal drive led important visitors directly to this beautiful room. It has changed little since it was completed in 1692 and offers wonderful views from outside. Here you will also see finest collection of paintings. The beauty room. The portraits in this room feature women who were part of the close circle of cousins and friends of the Sixth Duke and Duchess of Somerset, who rebuilt Petworth House into a Baroque palace. So, after a fire in 1714, Louis Laguerre painted a series of symbolic murals on the ceilings and walls of the grand staircase. They feature Elizabeth, sole heiress of the Percy family, who married the proud Duke in 1682, enabling the transformation of Petworth with her inheritance. 
I must say I was so mesmerized by the beauty of this artwork. Really stunning. Now you're looking at the carved room. This magnificent room is named for the intricate wood carvings by Grinling Gibbons that now frame its pictures. That's the red room. Red has always been a popular color onto which to hang old master pictures. This scheme was created by the third Earl in 1806 and restored in 2002 by the team at Petworth. So now you are looking at the North Gallery. In the 18th century, the second Earl of Agreement built this gallery extension to house his collection of classical sculptures. His son enlarged the gallery and added more modern art to the collection including works by Turnell and Blake. I must say this gallery is truly amazing. It's full of wonderful artifacts, painting and sculpture. So fascinating really. If you like my content, please consider to subscribe my channel. These vlogs take a lot of time and effort. Also, it will give me encouragement to create more interesting content. Thanks a lot for watching my vlog. Please enjoy the rest of the vlog. Bye.